Okay, okay, okay. So I think we're, this is like right when I spot a guy and I'm about to start blasting over a hill. Like I just barely spot him. Stream's gonna, it's gonna be pixelated just because it's a stream. Now you're dead. But, you know, that was just, I spotted a guy, shot at a guy, nothing special there. Let's, let's say all your raids were good today. Would you break down all the raids? No, no that'd be too much. Because I have only, I've really only had good raids today. So I think I rolled up here. I think I want to say, because I'm trying to remember. I think I rolled up here with the intention thing and I heard scav boss. But that might have been pretty so Let's wait a second. We'll be able to tell you step by step once what's going on. So I'm pre-nading that in case because right here is a common spot. Like this wall right here is a super common spot for players to sit. So I always pre-nade it because there's really no escaping a nade right there. So I'm closing the door so no one runs down from thirst. Uh, someone comes up from first or down from third. I'm also peeking down the hallway at the same time. I spot a dead body. There's a dead body down the hallway right there. Throw another nade to get some movement. But I fucked up the nade. Somebody, I think, somebody hears that I'm on the second floor though. Pre a common common spot. That's I always pre it because there's usually pieces, there can be people in there. So like right here, there's a guy. He, I hear him. He hears me. He's about to hard peek me. Ego peek catches the one tap. <laughs> I know it's clear down the hallway. No one no one moved around at the end of the hallway. I still got to be a little more cautious and peel it, peek it, and clear it. This is time in the Western Hemisphere, my friend. But I'm going for the two story jump. But then I hear. I hear movement like right above me and I, I kind of back off from it and then I start taking shots in the back. So right now, while I went to, instead of healing in the common open area, I don't know where the rest of the people are in dorms. So if I were to looted right in the center of the hallway and I didn't clear my back end, but it was kind of more just to get away from all the action for a second. I knew that I came in from the first floor side and it was clear originally. And so I went off to the farthest doorway to hide my sound from other players to push me. That was, that was actually good that I fucked that jump up. I kind of fucked it up on purpose though a little bit. So I'm hiding my audio, not giving any audible cues for someone to push up on me. That's a big one. Why do people make that mistake? They start healing and get fucked because of it. So now I'm finding my chill spot. I'm trying to sound horde a little bit, figure out where all the movement is, seeing if the AK guy chased me, checking the backside staircase, see if there's movement come through the bushes. Still hiding my audio, going to the furthest sides of the building. Makes me nauseous watching him play. I'll slow it down for my old people in chat. I got you. Man. <laughs> Doing inventory. You I'll know. slow it down. Gotta make sure I'll what you have left. You, How many nades? You sure you're supposed to flex? No, I run digital vibrance. Please, my boomer eyes can't handle it. I said I'd slow it down. Fine. So I'm just kind of sound over, and I know there's a guy at the end of the first. First door on ice cream side. So I'm trying to create an unanticipated peak. A lot of people peek from this side, but they do right hand peaks. And people do right hand peaks, one, because it gives you the best visual advantage to see as far down the hallway and as much of the hallway. But the left hand peaks are unexpected. Right hand peaks also sometimes are better, like this. Sometimes are better because you're, you don't chicken wing. You keep your shoulder tucked versus the left hand. You peek your whole body. But this guy doesn't know I'm there. I fucked up. He hit me. I'm pushing up. He's gonna throw a nade. Clear out, but we caught him. Got lucky with that one. Got lucky with that one. Dead. No idea. That was pure luck. Still hiding audio cues, getting furthest away from all the combat versus healing right next to that couch. Let people hear me. Kind of baiting around, looking around, sounding. So now, no. I see a guy catches me off guard, blacks out my leg. My biggest thing is trying to get my back covered so I don't have to worry about that angle. That door was covering my back. 
holding a tight angle, committing to it, because he'll peek to that grenade. Just kind of have to trust your sphincter on that one that the nade doesn't blow you up. But I was in a shit situation. I was exposed to the stairs. Somebody came down, exposed to this doorway. I needed to get out as quickly as possible. So I was kind of looking for, for a get out strategy. A little bit. But I couldn't commit if I wanted to go back to where I came from, get shot in the back, or go upstairs and possibly meet people I had no idea were, you know, where their position is. So I decided to try to hold angle, be low profile as possible. But you'll, you'll see me decide against it because I don't think it's the play because aiming down sides while leaning is kind of fucked in this game. So I'll throw a nade. I'll use the nade to cover me. So because most people, as we know, we won't peek when a nade's in right in front of you because you might die. So I'm using the nade to push him back as well as create some smoke to give me some concealment to find better cover and heal my body. I'm giving myself away at the laser, but I'm trying to make sure I get a guaranteed shot if he were to peek there so I could see the laser on his body. There's risk I was willing to take, but I threw the nade Got to make him get away from the doorway to hide my movement, ran away. I got to the complete opposite side that we had a fight on to suppress my sound so no one rushed me while I was healing. Because this is like when you're the most vulnerable, it's when you're healing. A lot of us have pushed, have pushed players when they're healing. A lot of juicy boys. Because as you know, your gun's not up. But right now, all I know about is I can confirm almost three guys. Two guys were fighting upstairs. There was one outside swinging around on me. And we're going to continue to have an engagement. Waldron, what's up, man? No, you can't shoot grenades in the bay. Sound whoring. Here's something. Nice. You're the goat man. He's peeking again. I actually don't know how I didn't kill him, but we traded we traded a couple blows. Run from me. Run from me. You don't want this. He's confident with his vector. Vector builds confidence. So now I anticipate he's not going to peek and he's going to get a little more crazy with it. He's going to look for a different a different angle approach because he knows I have that covered. I'm only going to get more stationary with it. So I changed my angle completely to a. Because who the hell ever stands on this couch? You usually expect people down the hallway. You don't expect a little bit of higher elevation on a first floor building. But I can hear him moving up, spraying bullets, okay? So my backside I know is good. I got to worry about this right window. And I, th I thought at this moment he was going to push to the right. So I slowed my movement to cover my sound. But he doesn't. I think he's trying to hit me with a switcheroo to keep my attention elsewhere. Almost try to push me back where the couches are, but I'm just gonna hold ground, hold what I know. Got my back covered right now. I got my my almost right side covered. I'll check the window. You'll see. So I did, that me turning my head was checking the window to see if he had an angle to shoot me in the ass. He didn't. So I knew I need to stay eyes forward. I can watch the staircase. I can watch at the doorway, and my back is covered. And I'll have audible cues to hear if anybody enters in the building. So keeping the tight angle, just covering it. I'm just trying to make sure my back wasn't exposed when I was on the couch. So I'm trying to figure out where he is right now. And you can hear him swinging around. He's trying to get as much distance not to give me audible cues, but he gets caught. I anticipated his play. Because he knew I had that doorway covered. I gave him more hits than he did to me. I should have moved right here. Here's a big mistake. I stood in front of this window. I'm overexposed in the front. I should have I should have tucked back in a room. Because anybody would have walked up to that window, they would have capped me. That was a bad mistake. But now I'm just sound whoring right now. Nice. Yo, Pyres, thanks for the eight months, dude. Uh, just because I didn't have any more 995. And actually, I kind of like um, A5 of A1. So I'm going to get higher elevation again. People don't anticipate someone standing on a lot higher of an object. So this guy's going to come down. His flashlight kind of hard to see. He's going to catch some blows. I just slid off the couch. Fucked up the shots. Could have, Probably should have got the kill right there. But, you know, make a couple mistakes. It's, it's only human.
I'm going to keep holding angle because I know this is the only angle he's charging from. I know my back's covered. I'll have audible cues if someone tries to hop through anything. What made you not push this guy after lighting him up? Because he could spin around and watch. So if if I push him right now, he's going to wait for me because he's working off my audible cues. And he I, and I heard he had a vowel earlier. So I know that vowel tears shit up. So if all he had to do was look up the stairs, then I, or look down the stairs, and me run into the gun, I'm at, it's a 50-50 chance, right? But I knew he was going to peek that window, so I'm going to rotate into the doorway, so I'm not in the hallway, and he's going to think I'm still in the hallway, and I'm push out when he's still getting set. Catch him. I think that was last kill, right? That was a short book. <laughs> I think that was last kill. A breakdown, boys. A breakdown. Yeah, I'm going to do some on deaths, too. Because I, I need to highlight mistakes. Like, I even highlighted a mistake there. I said, that window made a mistake right there. Should not... I was overexposed. But I'll correct it for next time.